This question was asked in Gate Electronics and Communication 2010 paper. We are asked to find out what is the value of current I in the circuit. This is a question from sinusoidal steady state response. Now we have an AC source of 12, 20 volts and its frequency is 10 power 3 radians per second. Now with given omega we can calculate the impedances of this inductance and this capacitance. What is the impedance here? There is J omega L that is equal to J into 10 power 3 which is omega into the inductance that is 20 into 10 power minus 3 entry that is 20 J. Now what is the impedance offered by the capacitance it will be 1 by j omega c that is 1 by j into what is omega is 10 power 3 into what is capacitance 50 into 10 power minus 6 that will be 1 by j into 0 0.05 it will be minus 20 j this this j coming to the top making minus j and now we have found out this as minus 20 j and here as 20 j now we have to find out what is the current for that we will first find out the voltage here and then find out what is the current through 1 ohm we can use voltage divider rule like in DC circuits that is the potential here what is the potential here what is the total resistance here total resistance of this part will be what is the equivalent impedance of these two elements that will be z1 z2 by z1 plus z2 since they are in parallel that will be 1 into minus 20 j that is minus 20 j divided by 1 plus minus 20 j that is 1 minus 20j. We have found out what is the equal limits. Now by using voltage divider rule we can find out what is the potential here. Let's say this potential be V1 and V1 will be equal to we have 20 divided by what is the total resistance that is 20j plus actually this will come as negative minus 20 j by 1 minus 20 j into this resistance that is minus 20 j by 1 minus 20 j in solving this we will get we can solve this expression using the calculator and we will get it as minus j now we have found out the voltage here that is minus j and what will be the current through 1 ohm that will be v1 by 1 ohm that is i now what is v1 that is minus j by 1 that is i equal to minus j amperes so this was asked in electrical first we have to find out what is the impedance offered by 20 millirie henry and by this capacitor we have found out that then we have found out what is the potential here to find out the current through this resistance easily so we have gone for voltage divider rule then once we found this potential we can easily find out the current through 1 ohm as v1 by 1 ohm so the correct answer is minus j amperes